Food lovers, welcome back to our channel where we explore the rich and diverse world of global cuisine. Today, we're diving into the heart of Portugal to discover a beloved dish with a fascinating history espetada. Hi everyone, today we're going to explore espetada, a traditional Portuguese skewer dish that's packed with flavor and history. But first, let's uncover some unknown facts about this iconic meal. Espetada originated in the stunning Madeira Islands, where it's traditionally made with large chunks of beef marinated in garlic, wine, and bay leaves, then grilled over an open flame. The word, espetada, actually comes from the Portuguese word, espetar, which means, to skewer. It's a straightforward name for a dish that's anything but ordinary. In Madeira, locals often marinate the beef in Madeira wine, a fortified wine from the region, adding a unique depth of flavor that sets it apart from other grilled meats. Traditionally, espetada is cooked on laurel branches instead of metal skewers. These branches infuse the meat with a subtle, aromatic flavor that's truly distinctive. Espetada is more than just a dish, it's a centerpiece of many festivals and gatherings in Madeira. During the famous Madeira Wine Festival, you'll find countless stalls grilling espetada over open flames. Espetada was originally a dish for the island's shepherds. They would prepare it while tending their flocks, using whatever ingredients they had on hand, which often included wild herbs and homemade wine. While beef is the most common meat used for espetada, you can also find variations with chicken, pork, and even seafood, each bringing its own unique twist to this classic dish. In some regions, Espetada is served with a special bread called bolo do caco, a round, flat bread traditionally baked on a stone slab. This bread perfectly complements the savory, juicy meat. Espetada is a social dish. It's designed to be shared with friends and family, making it a perfect choice for gatherings and celebrations. An interesting twist is that some modern versions of espetada include a drizzle of honey or a squeeze of lemon juice just before serving, adding a surprising layer of flavor. With its rich history and regional variations, espetada truly captures the essence of Portuguese cuisine simple, flavorful, and rooted in tradition. Whether you're enjoying it at a lively festival or a quiet family dinner, it brings a piece of Madeira's vibrant culture to your table. In Madeira, it's common to use not only laurel branches but also sugarcane skewers for espetada. The sugarcane adds a subtle sweetness to the meat as it grills. The traditional marinade for espetada varies widely across Madeira. Some families have secret recipes passed down through generations, often including ingredients like piri-piri, a type of chili, vinegar, and even citrus zest. Historically, espetada was a communal dish made during harvest times when communities would come together to celebrate and share food after a long day of work. Espetada was originally cooked over an open pit fire, with the skewers suspended horizontally above the flames. This method is still used today in traditional settings, giving the meat a distinctive smoky flavor. Modern interpretations of espetada can be found in upscale restaurants where chefs experiment with gourmet ingredients like truffle oil, exotic spices, and even molecular gastronomy techniques. While beef is traditional, 
Lamb and even game meats like venison and wild boar are sometimes used for espetada, especially in the interior regions of Portugal. Espetada is often served during special occasions such as birthdays, weddings, and religious festivals, symbolizing community and togetherness. One unique variation of espetada includes marinating the meat with a local spirit called aguardante, a type of Portuguese brandy, adding a rich and bold flavor. In rural areas of Madeira, it's not uncommon for families to grow their own herbs and spices used in espetada marinades, ensuring the freshest ingredients. Espetada can also be cooked indoors using a special grill pan or even a broiler, allowing city dwellers to enjoy this traditional dish without needing an outdoor barbecue. The concept of skewered meat dates back to ancient times, with evidence of similar cooking methods found in various cultures around the world. Espetada is Portugal's unique take on this universal cooking technique. In coastal areas, espetada can be made with fresh fish and seafood, offering a lighter but equally delicious version of the dish. Espetada is often accompanied by sides like milha frito, fried cornmeal, fresh salads, and boiled potatoes, creating a well-rounded and satisfying meal. Espetada was influenced by the culinary practices of Portugal's various settlers and traders, incorporating spices and techniques from Africa, Asia, and the Americas. In some rural parts of Madeira, Espetada is prepared during the traditional Festa do Espetada, a celebration dedicated to this beloved dish where entire communities gather to cook and enjoy Espetada together. Recipes for Espetada can be found in Portuguese cookbooks dating back several centuries, indicating its long-standing popularity in Portuguese cuisine. Choosing the right cut of meat is essential for a perfect Espetada. Traditionally, tougher cuts like chuck or shoulder are used, as they become tender and flavorful when marinated and grilled. Bay leaves are a crucial ingredient in the traditional espetada marinade, but other herbs like thyme, rosemary, and oregano are sometimes added to create regional flavor variations. Locally sourced beef is often used for espetada in Madeira, ensuring the freshest and most flavorful meat possible. Some farms even raise cattle specifically for this dish. Espetada has gained international fame and can be found on the menus of Portuguese restaurants around the world, from Brazil to the United States, adapting to local tastes while retaining its traditional essence. Thank you for joining me on this delicious journey through Portugal. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more culinary adventures from around the world. Até logo, and happy eating!